welcome back to another episode of Saving Customs. We're out in Blandford this afternoon. We just sat down by the River Stour, um, where, the bridge, where both the footbridge and the road bridge go across. So we're going to get some shots of those in a minute. We took Ruby out to the vets this morning. She got on all right, so we've got a few shots of that for you. Good for car aid. Hey, yeah. Hello, good morning, people. How are you doing? Too bad. We're, um, I'll take Ruby to the vet. She's got her annual booster. She's already getting an excited one in the back of the car, so we're going to make a move and uh, go on in. <laughs> Greeting everybody. Okay. Wow, are you say Did she jab you? Did she jab you, honey? Did she jab you, honey? An awful lot going on, isn't there, baby? Yeah? You're right walking round and round there, aren't you? Apart from making a lot of noise, she got on just fine. Didn't you, baby? So, uh, I'm waiting for Emma. She's just going to pick up some dog food and whatever else. And, uh, and we're going to head on back. So, thanks for coming with us. Shops is at an annual booster, and we'll catch you in a bit. Get the treat. Good girl. Oh, just one. You like that, kind? Just one, honey. Good girl. We also had to go grocery shopping again with Emma's mum, so we've got a few shots of that as well. Give her some. Behave yourself, Emma. Still at it. <laughs> Behave yourself, Emma. <laughs> Behave yourself. That is down there. Do you want some? Big ones. I wash myself with that, Ems. I can't find any washing stuff, so does that work? A bit of mould soap. Because yeah. it all into my regions. Mm -hmm. Get rid of the mildew. For damp areas. makes every bite into an unforgettable taste experience. Why do I imagine it tastes like perfume? How you doing? I've been asking you, do they do the extra white rolls or not? Okay. Just wrecking the place. Me taking a bite back someone. Buddy! I'm trying to make a move here, he's over there rustling his bag. Buddy! He's chuck a load of bread down next to us so the watch doesn't get us and then rustle his bag right next to my camera. I don't know. But yeah, anyway, we're down here this afternoon, chilling out. Rather windy in the UK at the moment. We've got some severe gales going on up the country last night and today. And uh, we actually managed to find this one quite down here. It's pretty really windy on that road. But yeah, we're just going to see you guys everywhere. We're going to look round and See what we can see, it's been a long time since I've been down here. And you as well. Um, so we're going to go to a few of my old haunts, in the old spots, and uh, make a movie. So we'll catch you in a bit. 
Cheers. <laughs> like my pad. Chile. We're just walking on down to the old bridge. There was a couple of shots from the, uh, the new bridge, the foot bridge. But yeah, here we are. Without further ado, please forgive me. I haven't done my homework, so I can't tell you anything about this bridge. But here it is. You can tell that it's a bridge because of the way that it is. That's neat. Well, where we are to now, boys, is the. Uh, last remaining two arches of the Dorset and Somerset Railway that used to run through here across the bay. Um, it was all done away with in 1966. As you can hear, there's quite some good acoustics in here, but as you can imagine, being a country area, plenty of people spent some time down there, even for teenagers. But yeah, just going to get some shots of this for you. And we're going to head on further up into town and maybe even walk around the town. I'm not sure what the plan is yet. But um, another thing we've got to do is test. Egg type we do for which is like for time lapsing, so um, we're interested to see what we'll do with that later. Hope we can maybe catch the sun coming down, something like that. But anyway, we'll catch you guys in a bit.
was a corn exchange town hall. Mate of mine, as we were teenagers, was a janitor down here. We had keys to get into all of this. You can actually get out on the roof and look around all of Blanford from here. But I won't say any names. And just behind us, the other side of the hedge, we've also got the moon going on, boys. You're getting an Arctic blast, aren't you? You're having an Arctic blast, are you? <laughs> Yeah. I'm having a blast too, honey, so it's all good. Good job. Yeah. Well, boys, thanks for coming on the adventure so far. You just filmed a bit of a sunset. We lost it in the clouds, so um, just seen the moon out, so we might get a few shots of that on the way back. Like I said, not going to be too much of a talking movie tonight. I've bored you enough for the last few days, so we'll show instead of do today, and uh, we'll catch you tomorrow morning. So thanks again once. Uh, <laughs> Tongue tied. <laughs> Always. Thanks once again for watching, and we'll catch you all in the morning. Cheers. <laughs>